Hi everyone, my name is Kate, welcome back to my Wonder Nighting channel and today I'm gonna show you some cute and useful crochet gift ideas that will be definitely used and will always remind people of you. Christmas and New Year are coming up, so it's perfect time to start thinking about gifts. I split these ideas by difficulty levels. First we go over simple projects that you can make quickly, then medium ones that can take a little bit more time, and finally more challenging ones that require more patience but are totally worth it. So let's get started! This video is sponsored by Skillshare. Since it's mid-November and the new year is approaching, I think it's perfect time to start learning a new skill to welcome new year and Christmas as a new version of myself. For example, right now I'm actively focusing on growing my YouTube skills, production, script writing, and all of this I'm learning on Skillshare. Skillshare is an amazing community for creators with thousands of classes in everything from design and productivity to marketing and even crochet. Whether you're just starting out or looking to refine your skills, there is something for everyone. And what I love about Skillshare is their learning path. Curated collections of classes that guide you step by step through mastering a specific skill. For example, I've been exploring classes to help with my creative process and it's been a great way to keep things fresh and inspiring. There are tons of categories to explore like design, animation or even growing your online business. Skillshare is really all about helping you learn by doing, which is perfect for hands-on creators like us. So if you're ready to take your creativity to the next level, you can join Skillshare today. The first 500 people to use my link in the description will get one month of Skillshare for free. So don't miss out, check it out and start learning today. So let's start with something small. It's a flower keychain or like any crochet keychains. It's an easy gift for all of your friends and you can make a bunch of them in just an hour. Use different colors for each one. For example, a color that reminds you of a particular person. These keychains are popular for decorating bags and backpacks. You can also add beads or tiny bracelets to make each one unique. I recommend using t-shirt yarn so the keychain will keep their shape for a long time. And how to make them? Well, you need to make a chain of air loops, then make three puff stitches, and then puff stitches around that first row, forming the flower. Add beads and that's it. And the next idea could be a cute addition to this keychain. A small and practical earbuds case. It's a great idea for anyone who always carrying their earbuds. I have one myself and it keeps them protected from any scratches or dust and if they are white, it protects them from getting tangled. And how to make them? Just crochet in a circle with single crochet stitches until you reach the desired height, then add closure. I recommend using thicker yarn for better shape like t-shirt yarn and mixing a few colors for a nice look. Next idea is a little granny square bag. A bag made from two granny squares, I think it's a cute and nice idea. A bag made from two granny squares, it's a fun, easy and practical accessory. And cute. Choose bright or pastel yarns for a unique design. And how to make? Crochet two matching granny squares, you can make them either big or small. Then stitch up the sides and the bottom, attach a strap and you're done. Next idea is super cute and of course easy too, it's a laptop sleeve. A stylish and practical laptop sleeve is a thoughtful gift. Just be sure to find out the laptop size first. You could go from natural colors for a classic look or bright pastels for something fun. You could even add pockets for extra convenience. You can use the granny square technique of crocheting in straight rows. I recommend adding an inner line to protect the laptop from scratches. But if you're using t-shirt yarn, which I also suggest for added protection, you can skip the lining. Next cute idea I would love to receive as a gift too is a makeup bag or crochet basket. Makeup bags or storage baskets are perfect for organizing cosmetics or small items. For a makeup bag, add a zipper to keep everything in place or make it with a ties or an alternative style. And how to make for the basket crochet in circle, increasing in size until the base is big enough. Then stop increasing 
and crochet just build up the walls and for the makeup bag you could follow the same steps as uh, for the laptop sleeve just smaller use sturdy yarn as lining if desired book cover it's a super cozy and cute crochet idea of course it's especially nice for book lovers you could also make it for an e-reader or even a tablet and how to make just crochet rectangular the size of the book then add pockets or flaps to hold it securely you could also use granny squares to make the corner pockets crochet small triangles sew everything together and your cover is done just reminding that this blog is still about cute crochet and quick gift ideas next idea is hair scrunchie scrunchies are simple to make and always in style i have a tutorial on my channel how to crochet a puff flower scrunchie so definitely try it out how to make the usual scrunchie crochet a rectangle wrap it around an elastic hair band and sew the edges together the next simple idea is a beanie hat the simplest beanie hat simple beanie is a universal gift for a basic design crochet a rectangle pull it tight at the top and you'll have a beanie how to make crochet in straight rows with single crochet, half double crochet or maybe double crochet, pull it tight on the top, your beanie is done. Next cute idea is of course crochet socks. Socks are very cozy and personal gifts and I have a tutorial on my channel how to crochet the most comfortable socks, so be sure to check it out. Granny Square Scarf I love the look of Granny Square scarf, especially with an edging. It has such stylish touch. And how to make? Pick a design for your squares, stitch them together and of course add edging to complete the look. And in general, I love the crochet scarf idea, because you can make various types of scarves combining different techniques like granny squares and straight rows. And these kinds of gifts are especially meaningful, because they feel like custom-made and unique making the recipient feel truly special. Unique hats, not only beanie, but general hats. Fun hats with ears, pom-pons or even fluffy yarn look so cute. And I recommend you to use some interesting, unusual yarn, so even the easiest crochet hat could look unusual. And actually, I'm planning to make one with long ties that can be wrapped around like a scarf, so stay tuned. Yes, I'm gonna make tutorial. How to make these hats? Crochet in rounds or straight rows, adding fun details like ears, pom-pons as you go. Granny Square West. A vest made of squares is a perfect for any age or style. This is a lovely gift for moms and grandmoms and it's easy to make in an oversized style, so sizing isn't a big worry. And how to make? crochet large squares and join them together leaving openings for the arms and if you add more squares it could even turn into a cardigan pillow cover crochet pillow cover is such a cozy gift and you can create it in a range of styles from classic to holiday themed for example a pillow shaped like a bow or candy cane would be adorable you could also make this with granny squares or other patterns and how to make crochet two squares stitch them together along the edges and add buttons or zipper and how to make the bow pillow just crochet a large rectangle stuff it and wrap a piece of yarn around the center to create a bow shape blankets and i'm really in love with crochet blankets a blanket is big and meaningful gift and if you're watching this in november you need to start to crochet your blanket right now it doesn't have to be bad size even a throw for a chair or couch can be wonderful and how to make you can use granny squares or crochet straight rows changing colors for a nice effect and i really want to make one for my best friend's daughter accessory sets matching set of head scarf and mittens or fingerless gloves makes a great impression 
If medium seems too complicated for you, try a simpler set. Bombers, gloves and scarf for example. And the main thing when you're crocheting the set is to stick to one color or style for the whole set. For example, everything crochet with slip stitches or single crochet. On my Etsy I have a pattern for mittens plus video tutorial and also interesting scarf and versatile beanie, so be sure to check it out, the links will be in the description. I had to include a section of men's gifts since it's always a bit tricky what to make for men and I made gifts for my husband that he still wears. So the nice gifts for men it's scarves, beanies and fingerless gloves for working on a laptop. Natural colors work best unless you know he likes something brighter. You need to use classic colors and style to ensure they go with any outfit. My dad and husband both love dark, natural colors, so I stick with those. But if you know the guy like bright shades, go for it. In general, when crocheting for men, use natural and understated colors so the item can match any style. That way they'll definitely wear it all the time, because men really appreciate when something is made for them. As you can see, I didn't include clothes, since it's harder to fit, but a granny square vest is exception, because it's oversized. But if you want to make clothes, just remember it takes a bit more time. For example, I have a pattern for this tapestry sweater on my Etsy. I think this sweater is a perfect winter clothes. It's cozy and just really beautiful. This sweater is crocheted. You can make it in various colors that everyone can wear. So check it out and back to presents. Don't forget to wrap them nicely, because presentations matters too. The devil in details. I hope these crochet gift ideas inspire you. This gift will make your loved ones happy and keep you close to their hearts. So be sure to subscribe to my channel, I have a lot of exciting tutorials and tutorials on holiday gift ideas on the way. In my next video I will share the gift ideas especially for us, crocheters, crochet makers, crafters, so you can drop a hint to your friends and family. Let me know in the comments if you have more ideas for simple and universal crochet gifts. And I thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye kiddos!